Good evening, everyone. I'm Sam Wright. If you scrolled through social media in the last few days, you may have seen a new video from Governor Christy Noem. In it, she praises a Texas company for the dental work she received in their office. In the last half hour, we've learned she now faces a lawsuit over that video. The consumer advocacy group at Travelers United filing the suit, claiming the governor has done an, quote, undisclosed advertisement for the company Smile Texas. More on that in a moment, but first, here's First Third Investigator Beth Warden. Amidst a sea of videos from Governor Nome regarding current affairs and politics, a new video is gaining attention. Well, hi, I'm Christy Nome. I'm the governor of South Dakota. Describing a trip to a Texas dental firm. Fix my teeth, which has been absolutely amazing. South Dakota Democratic Executive Director Dan Aller says politicians on a national scale are not allowed to make similar endorsements. At the federal level, the Hatch Act covers a lot of these types of issues with, uh, surrounding whether or not you can do endorsements. Uh, as far as I know, at the state level, we don't have those types of laws. I love it. I, I love that my bite is better. Just because it's legal doesn't mean it's ethical. And I think that's really the crux of this. Is this what our elected officials should be doing? I want when people look at me to hear the words that I say and not be distracted by something that um, I'm wearing or how I look. The response is polarizing, according to USD Associate Professor Emeritus Michael Card. This might be seen by her proponents as either well, she didn't want to insult any particular South Dakota dentist, so she went out of state. I also was able to get back on the road and back home to South Dakota as quickly as possible. Others may say it's an insult to South Dakota oral surgeons. And finally gave me a smile that I can be proud of. Some online have also questioned the timing and scope of the video. Noam is a leading candidate to be Donald Trump's running mate. She's also appeared in a series of ads to recruit people to live in South Dakota. Supporters may applaud Governor Nome for embracing an opportunity. Some of her opponents would, would argue uh, is that this is unbecoming of a governor of a state to do a product endorsement for a particular firm. In Sioux Falls, Beth Warden, Dakota News Now. We reached out to Governor Nome's office for more specifics about the video. We also asked if Governor Nome was under anesthesia during the process. If so, that would require her office to make the proper notifications of successors. As for that lawsuit, Traveler says in a tweet, quote, if you want to promote medical tourism on social media in exchange for money and or free or reduced price services, you can do that. Just make sure to put an ad as the first word in your caption to comply with the law. We'll let you know when we hear back. If there's a story you think that we should look into, email us at investigators at dakotanewsnow.com.